Okay guys, so today I will show you how to sync your video and external audio easily and on top of that totally free using VSDC free video editor. I will be recording my video using Canon DSLR camera with built-in mic and as a second audio source I will use simple Logitech webcam which should still improve my audio quality over the DSLR. So as you can see it's not a pro setup but should work for the purpose of this video. Ok guys, so one way to align the video and external audio is to create a visual and audible reference point at the beginning of your video or a scene. Um, the easiest way is to simply clap your hands, for example, uh, three times like this. And this will create for us an easy to locate later, kind of spiky looking audio waveform. So now let's go back to our software and see how it looks there. Ok, so before we jump into the VSDC, let's have a quick look at our waveform in Audacity, a great audio tool you can download totally for free. Please check video description for download links. VSDC won't give you such a detailed waveform as Audacity. So here in this section, you can see our three claps and how different they are compared to the rest of the wave, and therefore very easy to lock. Ok, let's jump to the uh, VSDC. As you can see here, uh, we are using an older version uh, 3.3 as opposed to the latest one, uh, which is uh, 5 point something. Uh, because in the latest one, waveforms are only available in a premium paid version. So if you are on a tight budget, I have provided a link where you can find version 3.3. It's below in the video description box. Ok, so let's sync our files now. I will create a new project and I will make this window slightly smaller. That's perfect. So let's add first our video to the timeline. I will click Add Object and I will select Video. My video I wanted to sync is here. I will click Open. In the next window I will click, I will click Sync Video. OK. So at this point I have a video, now we need to add our audio, we want to sync. So I will click again, add object, we will select audio, audio to sync, that's the file I am looking for and I will click open again, here is OK. And now I have both files added to my timeline. Now what we need to do is to click this uh, audio waveform icon on the left and from this drop down menu I will select show waveform. So here we go, the waveform is below the video and to make it a little bit larger I will just click four times zoom. Perfect. So now I want to repeat the same process with our audio file. So I will click this icon and select show waveform. Here we go. And to make it a little bit bigger, I will click here again and select four times zoom. So even from the distance, I can tell that these three claps are in this area. It's really very easy to lock it when you do these claps three times. So right now I can zoom in a little bit to make the alignment really easy. Perfect. And I will use this tool to kind of guide me uh, what is the alignment kind of point I want to use. So uh, I will adjust this like that. And now I see what's the perfect alignment here. And I think this is the point where the video and audio is perfectly aligned. So I can now zoom out and I can work on these files, cut them, trim them, uh, split, etc. And I know that my audio will be perfectly aligned. The last uh, kind of step that I should do is to click uh, the video file and disable the audio that comes from this file. So here in the properties window of the video, uh, I have an option audio track. Currently it's a track one. So I want to basically disable it. And from this menu here, 
I will choose Don't Use Audio. So now let's see before and after results. The easiest way is to simply clap your hands, for example, three times like this. And this will create for us an easy to locate late. The easiest way is to simply clap your hands, for example, three times like this. And this will create for us an easy to locate late. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comments section below. Cheers!